Button batteries can be very dangerous, especially if they're ingested by a child. Uh, the most dangerous ones are the ones that are like coin, uh, the, like the CR2032, the big one, uh, which we call as coin batteries as well. Uh, when the young ones uh, find them, they, they can swallow them and these batteries will then get stuck in the mid esophagus, which is the middle of the food pipe and they have uh, enough charge to cause burning and they also leak chemicals which can cause burning of the tissue. Uh, there are a lot of important structures around the middle of the esophagus, the big vessel that comes out of the heart, uh, the heart, the aorta, and these batteries can burn a hole through the tissue of the food pipe and can also burn a hole into the aorta, which then results in bleeding. And this can be very, very dangerous as this can result in significant morbidity or even death. If I put this battery onto this piece of uh, meat there, which is very similar to the tissue of the esophagus. Uh, you can see that within a couple of minutes, the, uh, it starts to bubble and then the tissue around the battery starts to go white, which indicates the onset of damage. And eventually within 10 to 15 minutes, you'll see that the tissue actually becomes black underneath, which means that the, the whole tissue is actually dead and burnt. As you can see, these are very dangerous uh, uh, ingestion cases. The button batteries uh, lying around in the house, they are quite uh, dangerous. So your parents and families have to be aware and make sure they secure the button batteries in the toys compartment, in the remote control compartment, wherever they use to make sure they are stored properly, ideally disposed and recycled in order to avoid this horrible button battery uh, injuries. If you suspect that your child has swallowed the battery, please come as soon as possible. Al Jalila Children's Speciality Hospital has 24-7 uh, endoscopy service with endoscopy technicians and endoscopies around the clock. Uh, and give honey if your child is above 12 months, five meals every 10 minutes because before you come to the hospital, it's safe. This will uh, reduce the damage.